the race is not over yet, but we have a strong front runner, as we already said here on the platform many times, and guys, is Borussia Dortmund. Hello guys, and welcome back on my channel from Fabrizio Romano, as every single day with a new video, and today it's time to talk about this boy, Karima Deyemi, together with Dujan Blaovic, the biggest attacking talent we have in European football right now, of course, we are not including players like Kylian Mbappé and Erling Golland, but... Adeyemi is doing amazing with Red Bull Salzburg and so what's next for his future? We have an important update and so let's talk about Karim Adeyemi together. And so guys, it's important to clarify that for Karim Adeyemi the race is not over yet, but we have a strong front runner, as we already said here on the platform many times, and guys, is Borussia Dortmund. They want to sign Karim Adeyemi, but let's clarify the whole situation. The agents of Karim Adeyemi had meetings with many clubs and were approached by many clubs. They had a meeting with Inter in Milano, in Italy, where I live, and Inter were trying to ask about the situation, but they know that it's going to be super difficult. They had a contact, a direct contact also with Liverpool, because they've been scouting Karim Adeyemi for a long time. He's kind of striker, he's fast, he's scoring goals, so he's kind of striker, super interesting for skills, for Jurgen Klopp kind of football. Then they had a contact and a meeting with Barcelona because Barca are looking for players for the future and so they made an inquiry for Adeyemi they had a meeting with his agent so Barca were and are strongly interested in Adeyemi but from player side the club that he sees as the perfect step for him is Borussia Dortmund. Why? Because they play in the Bundesliga and Karim Adeyemi feeling is after Red Bull Salzburg move to Bundesliga could be the most smart way to continue his way, his career, and same as Erling Haaland did from Salzburg to Borussia Dortmund could be the best way for him. And then at the end, Borussia Dortmund position, they've been pushing with him. They are really close to reach an agreement with Karim Adeyemi on personal terms. It's not 100% completed yet, but they are really, really close. They made a very good proposal and they would give him the chance to play as a starter. They don't know yet what is going to happen with Erling Haaland in Borussia Dortmund board, but they know that with a player like Donny Malen, that will be a player for the future and for the present, but also with Karim Adeyemi, they will have have two fantastic jewels in attacking positions and this is why they want to sign Adeyemi as soon as possible. Borussia Dortmund are on it, they still don't have a total agreement with Red Bull Salzburg, so between the two clubs it's still in negotiation and we will see what will be the final fee, but Borussia Dortmund have open talks and hope to find an agreement soon with Red Bull Salzburg. With Adeyemi, is at final stages for his contract, it's going to be a five-year deal for Adeyemi with Borussia Dortmund. And as I said, it's not done yet, but the other clubs involved in this race, Liverpool, Inter and in particular Barcelona, they already know that the Yemi decision is to give priority to Borussia Dortmund. Now they have to find an agreement with the player and with Red Bull Salzburg, so they are still in negotiation moment, it's still not a here we go, but Borussia Dortmund are confident because they know that the Yemi is open to join them. And so guys, let me know your thoughts on Karim Adeyemi. This boy, he's doing great in Champions League. He's doing great with Salzburg. So I wait for your comments. Where do you see Karim Adeyemi in the next season? Send me your comments. And guys, as always, remember to subscribe to the channel, to be part of the family, like this video, turn on your notification bell, and I wait for you every single day with a new video here on my YouTube channel. Ciao from Fabrizio.